Hey guys, uh, let's talk about stuff. I actually have something, ooh, I have something really kind of interesting. Maybe, sort of, that's the subjective thing. Yeah. Okay, so the thing I want to talk about. Uh, I was actually just talking to somebody at work today about this. We had a pretty good conversation, banter, back and forth. We were talking about, talking, actually. It was about small talk and how I, I voiced that I don't, care for it at, like at all. I don't think it's a good thing. I actually think it's kind of bad for social intelligence, meaning the ability to communicate your thoughts and actually express what you're feeling and, and what you want to say and so forth. And by this I mean I don't mean little things to talk about that lead to greater conversations when you meet new people. I mean the types of conversations that go on at a party or with new people, possibly at a job, that both people know yeah, this, this really isn't going to amount to anything, so I'm just going to talk about stuff that I think I should be talking about. Like, just for me, I don't find the value in just talking- oh, okay. Hi. Go away! No one wants the news from the view of a bird. Yeah, I don't particularly care for small talk. I think it's a good thing for people to be polite and just kind of say, hey, what's your major? Or hey, where else do you work if you have another job? But unless you actually want to know that, don't ask me. Again, that's a nice of you, but I'd rather you actually ask me questions you want to know the answers to. Like, it just drives me kind of nuts. It drives me a little crazy sometimes when people just, because they ask questions like that and then they just don't really elaborate in their answers or once, you, once they get an answer with, with their responses, uh, it's more like they're just kind of just killing time. I don't know what people are doing. I myself, when I talk to people, strangers or friends, more times than not, I guess it would be big talk, sort of big picture stuff and abstract stuff. And not always, but you know, we still talk about Mass Effect or food. I don't know. But when, when I'm talking about like when a conversation really does get going, it's usually big stuff. It's usually big picture things. And I just don't know how people can just settle for regular conversation every day. Like how few people think abstractly about thinking or think about talking or think about listening or what people are actually saying to them when somebody actually says something. And by actually, I mean words, a real response. And it, again, it just bugs me a lot. I can't stand people. That cicada, man. You are invading. He is invading on audio territory. Yeah, that's right. Small talk. Don't do it. It's bad for your brain. It's nice if it's for single serving friends, but I mean, who wants that? You know, even if it's, you know, it's just gonna be a one time encounter. Have fun with it and ask good questions and try and be insightful or reflective. And if you're not genuinely interested in the person, then stop talking to them. Just don't. That's, yeah, that's what I'd say. Say what you want to say and see where you overlap with people because I think that's a real human experience. I think that's actually how people should talk to other people. What do you think? Is small talk a good thing? Is it a bad thing? Is it just kind of whatever? Are you apathetic towards it? Do you like it? Because there are some benefits to small talk. Like it allows you to sort of get in just little tidbits here and there that aren't really big picture things to talk about and just kind of fit within a little nice package of a conversation. Yeah. Oh. Again, comments, leave me one. Thanks for watching. Oh, every time I do that, he stops.